It was all Irish murals. Now the first and the last one is Irish. In between, it's all supporting Gaza. Yeah. They've always supported Gaza and this area. Or not Gaza, Palestine, you know? Uh huh. The Palestinian flags have always been flowing, mostly in any sort of Catholic nationalist area. Basically, the, way, the reason why they do that, the people that would have traditionally painted these murals, but this time he's dead on hunger strike for 66 days until he cost him his life. It was a, a rebellion against British rule. It mostly happened in Dublin, but in Republican areas, they still commemorated every Easter Sunday, and that's what those flags would have been put up for. when they first arrived. <coughs> That's the, the peace wall in Belfast still. Still separating the uh, Catholics and the Protestants on, on one side and the other. Uh, you think the only ones in Israel with uh, Israel and Palestine, but it's not. Still one here. I find the new houses that they're building here to replace the old ones that don't have that sort of gable anymore, you know, and there's not as many. Uh -huh is what there would have been, but where years ago all the old rules of terrace houses, there was always an end gable. Yeah. You can't use it for football. If yeah, you yeah. In the, end house, <laughs> the ball was bouncing off your wall. I'm sure it would have been quite annoying. Do you think they'll have to repaint <coughs> the 56 where that 55 is? <laughs> <laughs> Next season. <laughs>
Sunni mural now. I'm a shy girl of what you're saying. Started with the UVF, that's how he died, and he was, he was murdered by the UVF.